Dennis Melinda and the Chair and Mission Outreach Team for Dennis. Thank you so much for being here. You're Thank welcome. You. Thanks yeah. for asking us. Yes, you guys have some big events coming up. Can you tell our viewers a little bit about what's going on? Well, uh, in October, the, towards the end of the month, coming up very quickly actually, um, the United Women in Faith are having their biannual rummage sale. Okay. We do this twice a year. And I think I was here in April when mm -hmm. we uh, had our spring one. How did the spring one go, Melinda? Um, about as good as we normally good. have. Nothing, you know, extraordinary. But it still is a, a good profit uh, for our mission effort. Um, the money that's raised from the products that are sold uh, goes to missions overseas as well as staying in, in Jackson. Okay. So it's a big um, project for the women and we enjoy getting it all together and, and making it a success. But we're doing it two days this time. Oh, nice. nice. And uh, I think we had two days yet last, last year. We were open Wednesday night and Thursday. So we're doing that again. Okay. And on Wednesday, we will be open from 3 in the afternoon until 7 p.m. Okay. So, um, you know, for the people that are working during the day and can't get to us, mm -hmm. um, this will work out better for yeah. their uh, schedule and bring the kids because then they won't be in school. But then Thursday, we're going to start at 9 o'clock and we will have the opportunity for you to come in, purchase a bag for $3.00, Whatever you can put in that bag oh for three dollars is yours. You're That's speaking amazing. my language now. Right. All right, yeah, there you go. Good. And then Sailor. from one until three, everything's free. Just oh come gosh. in, take what you can take. Yeah. We want to make sure that everyone has an opportunity, um, whether they have the finances or not. And these mm -hmm. are normally very low priced items sure. anyway. Yeah. But we want it to be a benefit for the people in Jackson that they can come and find some things for themselves. With the holidays coming up, I think people should keep in mind, like everybody needs extra um, platters and bowls and yes. candlestick holders for your events when you are hosting. But also finding really unique gifts or things that can be sure. repurposed is such a beautiful you know, way to share something cool with people at the holidays. So hopefully people will be thinking about that. Yes, exactly. And we also have holiday items. We oh. have Thanksgiving, mm -hmm. fall type arrangements, Christmas things, as well as toys for the kids. You know, it's an opportunity mm -hmm. for people to come in and, and find some things for the little ones. And uh, in addition to clothing, okay. we have clothing for men and women and children, nice. all different styles. There's casual, there's professional, there's, okay. there's uh, you know, lots of uh, different uh, articles to pick up, so. No. Dennis, what else is going on at the First United Methodist Church? November 10th at 3 o'clock in the afternoon, that's on Sunday, we're doing our third gospel concert. Okay. Uh, we are thrilled to have uh, nationally known Sherry Ann perform. Oh, wow. Um, she is uh, multi-talented. She is a singer. She is a, a lecturer. She's an author. Uh, and uh, I've seen her perform three times. I saw her at the National Quartet Convention in Pigeon Forge. Uh, I've seen her at the Gospel Arn in Hillsdale, and uh, uh, her message and her faith-building music is simply incredible, and she's also doing a salute uh, for our veterans because Sunday is Veterans Day. That's great. That's great. All are welcome. Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, doors open at 2. Uh, the uh, ticket price is $10 for adults. Children 12 and under are free. That's awesome. Very good. And $10, you, that's Yeah, you guys cool. always have so much going on. I won't mention Christmas. But <laughs> yeah. You guys, I mean, oh, so, many, so many things going on around the holidays. I know the holidays are a special time at First United Methodist Church. Of course, we are, we're known for our Christmas Eve services, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, uh, we are already uh, working on, on that part. Right. Uh, Melinda and I are both in the choir, yeah. right. and uh, so practice, 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 yeah. get started. Uh, but we have these these customary events uh, leading up to it. Yeah. So uh, we, we stay pretty busy. Yes, we do. Well. I will put a plug in for our collage concert, oh. which is the first Sunday in December. I can't oh, remember goodness. the date off the top of my head, but that's open to the public. And it's our opportunity to give back to the community. 
an opportunity for you to get into the Advent season. It's the first Sunday, and I believe it's at 3 o'clock. Okay. on whatever that date is in December, mm -hmm. the first Sunday in December. So. What are we looking at? We are looking at the first. Yeah, is December, December 1st. 1st. Okay. Well, let's so talk uh, rummage sale one more time. I want to get those dates dates on the screen again because that right. is coming up. It's That's next it. week. And right. you want to get rid of everything that you guys have. So yes. show up for sure. That's it. Should be fun. And there's always treasures too. Oh, You've yeah. probably there's found a treasure too over the years, I assume? I have. As a matter of fact, I cannot uh, uh, say I haven't snooped. Ah, <laughs> and, did you and, pick and, it? And, 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 <laughs> ask, actually, I did. Um, along with all of this going on, we also have a school backpack program that That's we right, do. Backpack yeah. giveaway. So when I'm packing on Fridays, I can kind of snoop before the doors <laughs> nice. open. And uh, I've found some treasures. Very yeah. Nice. Nice. And the price, you can't beat it. Yes. Right. It's, it's, it's such a deal. Yes, come treasure hunt at the rummage sale. Yeah, set. thank you guys so much for being with us today. You're welcome. Pleasure. We appreciate it. Melinda thank Long you. and Dennis Hayek from First United Methodist Church here on The Morning Show. We'll be right back. Stay with us.